Hi everybody and welcome to another edition of Endless Golf. I'm your host Bobby Vermillion. Today we're here at the beautiful Lynx at Lighthouse Sound right here in Ocean City, Maryland. And Lighthouse Sound is part of Ruark Golf, which offers a number of other great golf courses right here in the Ocean City, Maryland area. In just a moment, Diego Carrasco will be here to show us around this beautiful Arthur Hills design, so stay with us. Welcome to Endless Golf with Bobby Vermillion. Endless Golf is brought to you by your local Toyota dealer. Toyota, let's go places. Discover Ocean City, Maryland. Book your Ocean City Golf getaway now at ococean.com. Geico, 15 minutes could save you 15% or more on car insurance. And by Pam's Ocean City Golf Getaways, the official golf package provider of Ocean City, Maryland. Joining me here at the beautiful Lynx at Lighthouse Sound in Ocean City, Maryland to show us around this beautiful Arthur Hills design is Diego Carrasco. And Diego, welcome to the show. And could we have picked a better day to highlight this great golf course. Absolutely not, it's absolutely beautiful. Usually get a little bit of wind out here, but today we got a great day. Nice 65 degrees and sunny. So. And today we're gonna play two great golf holes, 13, a terrific par three. And then the finishing hole here at Lighthouse Sound, the par five number 18, just two uh, great golf holes. But really there's not a bad hole on this golf course. No, absolutely not. Everything is in immaculate shape right now. You know, fairway is about 75 yards wide, but if you put it in some rough, you can get in some trouble out here. But every single hole out here is a, is a beautiful view. About 12 holes out on the bay. Absolutely. We have to tip our hat to your uh, superintendent, Tom Akers. He's been here since the golf course opened. His staff always does a great job of taking care of this golf course. There are some battles, obviously, with the bent grass in the summer times, but I tell you what, you know, this golf course is always in great shape. Absolutely phenomenal. Yeah, Tommy's been here since it opened and he does a great job every single year for us. All right, let's take a look at the front nine. We'll begin with the terrific par four. A great way to start your round here at Lighthouse Sound. A great opportunity to make a birdie. Yeah, absolutely. And you have a bunker that guards that left side there. That's, that's not really the one you're worried about. You got a big waist area in between hole number one and hole number eight. Um, but you hit a good tee shot, you should have a short iron into a large green and good birdie opportunity to start off your round. And then moving to a very intimidating tee shot, and that is the par five number two. Yeah, par five number two. Um, as I said, you know, fairway 75 yards wide, but if you haven't played the course before, there is a big penalty area, big pond on the right side, which you can't necessarily see from the tee box, especially if you're playing a little bit back. But again, you find the fairway out there, you should have a really, really good opportunity to make a birdie. Um, opportunity to get there in two if you hit a good one. And then moving to the par three, number uh, number three. And I will say this, I've got some great memories from that hole because I have a hole in one there and that was pretty crazy. But yep. that is a shared green with number two. I was actually playing with a friend of mine, Mark Clark, and he hit it in the hole on the second <laughs> hole. So it wasn't a hole one, he hit it in the wrong hole, but what a great hole that is because Absolutely. it is a shared green. Absolutely, it is a shared green. Uh, there's a pretty nasty bunker there on that right side. Um, but if you take it on and you hit it on that right side of the slope, it can feed towards the hole. And as Bobby said, you can, Get a pretty good chance of getting it close maybe even in and then moving to a very challenging par four and that is number four yeah number four one of our signature holes here right out on the bay you see the ocean city skyline coming off the tee um, pretty hard tee shot you know you have to make sure that you take the right line there but as long as you can pop it over about 200 yards you can you can make sure that you at least give yourself a chance at par and then the par three number five another signature hole here at lighthouse sound and really you got to figure out what club to hit on that hole yeah, number five is tricky. You know, you definitely have to make sure that you're assessing the wind. A lot of times it's straight back into you, so you have to make sure that you're picking at least the right club enough to get over that carry there. But a really, really great golf hole. When you find the green there, you make a par, you feel really good about yourself. And one of the most unique tee boxes you'll find anywhere is on the par four number six here at Lighthouse Sound. It plays right in the middle of the bay there. You have to play that tee if you're playing this golf course. Just play it back a little bit. Uh, and it's a very difficult hole from back there as well. Right, absolutely. I mean, it's a, it's a short par four on the card, but uh, if you're out there on that back tee box, it is definitely an intimidating tee shot. Uh, but again, you get the ball in the fairway there, you should have a short iron into the green. Uh, green's a little bit tricky. It's a pretty long green. You know, you got to find the right tier to it. but. You know, as long as you get the ball in play on that tee, you should have no problems whatsoever. And then moving to the par five, number seven. Uh, par five, number seven, again, really, really great risk reward hole. Off the tee box, you know, you do have to, if you're a longer hitter, you do have to cut the corner a little bit. You have to take it over the trees. Um, if you're a shorter hitter, you can lay out to the left a little bit. Again, risk reward hole. So there's a big creek that guards the front side of the approach. So 
you have to make sure either you lay up to a good number before it or you have to have enough to get over it long. So You know, Diego, when I stand on the tee on number nine, I'm always trying not to give one back there because that's a very challenging par four. Yeah, and, and it doesn't look, it doesn't look uh, when you play the hole, it doesn't look like it should be a hard hole, but the tee shot is very, very narrow. It's easy to get blocked out, and that green is really, really hard to hit, one of the narrowest greens on the course. So, you know, usually if you walk out of there with five, you're doing a good job. Well, let's take a look at the hole we're going to play first this morning, and that is the par three, number 13. You've made some changes to 13. 13, yes, we actually added railroad ties to the front side of that bunker. Um, normally, that would be a shot that you, if you hit that lip in the front, it would roll back into the bunker, your ball's still okay. But now we definitely have to force that over that bunker and make sure that we get long. A miss there is going to be long for us, so hopefully we can find a green. All right, let's hit the 13 tee, see if we can't make a birdie. All right, guys. So. Here at number 13, we just discussed some of the changes there. As you can see, we did a beautiful job with those railroad ties there in the front of the green. So about 168 to the pin, probably playing about 175 back into the breeze here. Beautiful golf hole. Pulled a little left, but be Should enough. hang on the green there. All right, good got, shot. Got a little friendly good kick shot. there. Should have about 10, 12 feet. I tell you what, you hit the right club. Again, long is better than short here, right? Absolutely, Bobby. You always want to take one more here. You don't want to run the chance of hitting those railroad ties because then you're up to the golf gods there. All right. Got my little hybrid here. Put a good swing on it. Yeah, Bobby. Stay in the air. That one. Stay in the air. Oh, just got over. Just got over. Should I'll be about 10 it. high. Well, Diego, I can tell you one thing. We do not want to hit those over, that's for sure. We absolutely didn't, but I think we both had a pretty cl good club there. Absolutely. Bobby got it inside of me, so it looks like I'm out. Uh, just uh, up the hill, a little right to left in it, but not much. Bobby, you mind pulling that for me? Absolutely not. Knock it in. Yeah, let's see what we can do here. Good looking roll. Oh, yes! <laughs> well, that's how you draw it up, right, Bobby? That was a nice, firm, straight putt. <laughs> <laughs> hit it hard just in case it goes in. That's, that's when you know you're young and you have no nerves when you hit it <laughs> like that. Great putt. Good looking stroke there. Uh, all right, nice three. Take three on this hole yeah, all the time. Yeah, I tell you what, great golf hole with a two and a three. Anytime, anytime, right? absolutely. Well, welcome to the show, my friend. I tell you, our first show we had a chance to do it together. Yeah. You make a great birdie on a terrific uh, golf hole here. The changes are beautiful with the with railroad ties. When we come back, we'll play the par five number 18 here at the beautiful Lynx at Lighthouse Sound in Ocean City, Maryland. So stay with us. Pam's is the biggest and the best. Nobody does Ocean City Golf better. October Legends of Golf Deal. Play Bayside Resort, Bear Trap Dunes, and River Run for one great price. Three round, two night weekday packages, including daily breakfast per golfer, starting from only $3.75 per golfer. Call us at 888-222-GOLF. That's 888-222-4653 or visit us online at tv.pamsocgolf.com. We'll do all the work so you can have all the fun. Ah, beautiful day in Baltimore, where most people probably know that GEICO could save their money on car insurance, right? You see, the thing is, GEICO, well, could help them save on boat insurance too. Hi. Okay, I'm ready to come in now. Hello. I'm trying my best. Seriously, I'm, I'm serious. Request to come ashore. Geico. Saving people money on more than just car insurance. Introducing Toyota Reserve, the fast and easy way to secure your new Toyota, even if it's still in production. And with 10 manufacturing plants right here in the U.S., your new Toyota is closer than you think. And now's a great time to cash in on getting top dollar for your trade. 
So contact your dealer and reserve your new truck, car, or SUV today. Toyota, let's go places. Hi, it's Marjorie and Stephen Fun. We're the Fun family. People often ask, where do the funds go to have fun? Ocean City, Maryland! Ocean City's middle name is Fun. Ironic, because our last name is Fun. Is that fun? If you're looking for family fun, take it from the fun family. Book a week in Ocean City, Maryland. Go to ococean.com. And don't miss free events like Family Beach Olympics. Welcome back to Endless Golf and the beautiful links at Lighthouse Sound. Staying with me here at Lighthouse Sound is Diego Carrasco. And Diego, what a great day to talk about the course. We talked about the front nine earlier and had a chance to play the par three number 13, just a gorgeous golf hole. In just a minute, we'll play the par five number 18. We want to mention uh, you host a number of, uh, of outings here as well as weddings. And the, 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 the setting here at the clubhouse here at Lighthouse Sound is just spectacular. Yeah, we got a beautiful clubhouse overlooking the bay. Um, Great gazebo out here for weddings and events and stuff like that. But yeah, we have a lot of really, really great events here and people have a lot of fun when they come. I actually got married in the clubhouse. So <laughs> it was a great event and, and uh, loved it here and still love visiting Lighthouse Sound every time, especially to play a great round of golf. Let's take a look now at the back nine and we'll begin with a terrific hole. Uh, number 10 is really a great par four. It gives you a chance to make a birdie. You can drive the green on 10 depending on what tee and what wind conditions are Abs there that day. Absolutely, absolutely. After the tough number nine, 10 is a little bit of relief there. You can hit pretty much anything that you wanted off the tee. If you if you have that right to left ball flight, you can definitely pop one on in one. Um, but you could even hit a seven iron off the tee and you'd still have a wedge into the green. So And then moving to a very challenging par three and that is number 11. Yeah, number 11, one of the harder par threes out here, straight back into the wind most of the time, uphill, guarded green. If you put it in that left bunker, you're gonna have a, a rough time making par. But Moving to number 12, a, a terrific par five. I think the key on number 12 is Guys always blow it to the right there. There's a little more room left there than you think. Yeah, there is a little bit more room left than you think. And you know, really on that hole, it's just about getting it off the tee box. Um, if you're off the tee box in play, you normally the, the play is to lay it up before that green, uh, that fairway bunker there. If you try to get it over that bunker, it gets really, really skinny and it's not a lot more of a, of a shot from laying it up before the bunker. You have a good look at par. And then moving to the par four, number 14, a hole where you can grip it and rip it. Absolutely, fairway, again, probably one of the widest fairways on the course, but I, I will caution you, if you do miss the fairway there, the rough is pretty thick, especially on that left side. Long hole, but you usually should be able to have at least a six or seven iron into a pretty big green. And then a hole that gives you some options as a par four, and that is number 16. Yeah, great, another, another really good scoring hole for you, short hole. You can hit driver and put it down there inside 100 yards if you're comfortable with the wedge game, but you can hit a hybrid or a three wood off the tee and still have a short iron in. Well, 16 is a shorter par four, but 17 is not. It's a long and very challenging par four. The good news on 17, a large green. Great, yeah, a large green, you have a lot of chance to run it up if you get a little bit out of position. Um, it is a dog leg left, but off of the tee, you don't want to go too far left. Again, that rough on that left side of the hole is definitely penalizing. So again, a good straight shot there gives you an opportunity to score late in the round. And if you want to finish around with the birdie, you have an opportunity to do that on the par five number 18. Not a whole lot of wind today, so it may be gettable for you for sure. Um, but, but I tell you what, it's a great way to finish around. It, the, the elevated green just gives you a great setting of the skyline of Ocean City. Right, and you, you, come back in, you come back into 17, 18, you got that view again of the skyline. And it's a really, really great way to finish off your whole or finish off your round and normally is a scoring opportunity for most players. Well, you've already made one birdie this morning. Let's see if you can't make another. Yeah, why not? Let's, Let's do, do it. it. All right, Bobby, we're here at the beautiful 18th hole, dog leg left, par five. Pretty short one, so definitely an opportunity to get home in two, but got to make sure that you find the fairway out there to do so. Got a little wind left to right, so uh, going to be hard to get it down that left-hand side. Yeah, I would think so. Let's just try to take the safe line and get one out there in the middle. That's perfect. Perfect. Yep, that should work just fine. Should have about 210, maybe 200 yards into the green. Right. Mine will not look like that, I promise you, Diego. Ah, oh, Bobby, you got a good <laughs> swing. Let's put a good pass on All it. All right. Stay out of that bunker. Get over it. Just to the right of it. Just to the right of it. Should be just fine. Well, Diego, with that tee box and the wind being a little left to right, pretty much a three-shot golf hole for me. So I'm going to take my hybrid, try to knock it back in the fairway. A little awkward stance here. 
It's all right. Put a good pass on it. Should all be right. able to get it inside 100 there. I'll yeah, take it. Yeah, great swing, Bobby. I'll take it. That'll play just fine. All right, Bobby, hit a pretty good one here. Got about 200 yards in. As you can see, elevated green, and it's protected by that tree in the, in the front. So straight back into the wind, full club and a half up for me today. Hit a good one. That tree is uh, right in front of the flag stick, so right is a good miss. A little bit right. That'll play, though. That'll play just fine. Plenty of green to work with. Be a chip and a putt. Yep, good safe shot. All right, Diego, I'm in perfect position. I've got 100 yards, probably playing more like 110. Just hit it to the right of flag stick, try to get it close here. That's hit a good one here, Bobby. Yeah, good strike. I didn't hit it great, but get away with it. We'll take it. Yep, about 10, 15 feet for birdie. All right, Bobby, had the right club here, just missed a little bit right, but as we said, that was the miss there. So, got some green to work with, but this is a little bit of a speedy pitch, so gonna give this one some height. Get it close. Good looking shot. All right, we got two birdie putts at it. Two birdie looks, we'll take it. Hit a little heavy, but she'll do. Diego, so far so good. I actually, I'm a little closer. Yeah, I think, again, that worked out for me pretty well last time though, so let's see if yep. we can't do it again. Your, stay, your streak is alive. It's still alive, that's, uh, that is correct. Go ahead and knock it in there. It's be great birdie birdie this morning. Absolutely. Let's see if we can't do that. Little left to right, probably, you know, maybe maybe about a ball out. Just depends on the pace there. Looks good. Looks good. <laughs> good putt. Thank you, Bobby. I'll tell you what. Let's see, if you awesome. can't, let's see if you can't follow me in there. You know what? A lot of people say, do you do this on the first take? Well, both of those were on the first take. So he's I playing like some good golf this every morning. Now and then. You're playing good golf this morning. All right, Bobby, follow me in. You got it. Another good one. And that's oh, how you do yeah. it. <laughs> Great birdie, Bobby. Thank you. Thank you. I tell you what, what a way to end your morning here at the beautiful links at Lighthouse Sound. Birdie, birdie on the par five number 18. Uh, just a great way to, to spend your day because this is a great, this is just a great golf course. Absolutely, and you're finishing here with the skyline on 18. You can't, you can't be in a bad mood coming off birdie, birdie, finishing your round. We come back, Diego will have our tip of the week. So stay with us. Introducing Toyota Reserve, the fast and easy way to secure your new Toyota, even if it's still in production. And with 10 manufacturing plants right here in the U.S., your new Toyota is closer than you think. And now's a great time to cash in on getting top dollar for your trade. So contact your dealer and reserve your new truck, car, or SUV today. Toyota, let's go places. Ocean City Golf Club, featuring 36 holes of championship golf. The beautiful Newport Bay Golf Course and the classic Seaside offer golfers two very distinct designs to choose from. Ocean City Golf Club blends spectacular views of the surrounding bays, woods, and wetlands with the enjoyment of quality golf. Come experience 36 of the most challenging and picturesque golf holes you'll find anywhere. Ocean City Golf Club in Ocean City, Maryland, changing the course of golf in Ocean City. Oh, I've travelled all over the country talking about saving with GEICO, but that's the important bit, isn't it? Showing up, saying, hello, fancy a nice chat. And then we talk like two old friends about sticky buns and all the savings you could get by bundling your home and car insurance. But here's the real secret. Eye contact. Do you feel that? We just had a moment. <laughs> Who'd have thought it? GEICO. Save even more when you bundle home and car insurance. Hi, my name is Stephen Fun, and this is my wife. Hi, Marjorie Fun. And these are the Fun Kids. We vacation in Ocean City, Maryland, because this town has our name written all over it. <laughs> fun, family of four, fun. <laughs> We're the funs, not the borings. If you're looking for family fun, do what the Fun family does. 
Book a week in Ocean City, Maryland. Go to OCOcean.com and don't miss free events like movies on the beach. Welcome back to the Lynx at Lighthouse Sound. We're here at the front of the beautiful 17th hole. Uh, here, I'm going to give you guys a little golf tip here. Uh, a lot of times you'll find yourself in this position on this specific hole or maybe a hard par four where your ball's not necessarily on the green, but we're just on the front. And a lot of times, a lot of players will instinctively go for the highest lofted club in their bag, you know, 60 degree wedge, 56. Um, and especially early in the morning, you know, ground's still a little wet. A lot of times you could either, you know, dig too far in and just leave it on the front of the green or, you know, try to scoop it up and we end up, you know, back off the green. And, and those are both really frustrating shots to happen when we haven't played the hole particularly bad. Um, so here today, I'm going to give you guys a little tip. Um, I have my three hybrid in my hand. You know, you could use, you know, a five iron or maybe even, you know, a five wood, something, something with a little bit more loft on it. Um, this will allow it to get through this first area of the fringe, low to the ground, and it's going to make sure that it, the ball doesn't get kind of eaten up by this early morning dew. And, you know, it's a really, really consistent shot for us to be able to find more greens. So I hit a couple balls for you to kind of demonstrate. Um, you don't want to swing this club like it's a hybrid. We want to kind of use a putting stroke. Um, and we're just going to try to get that ball around the green here. Nice smooth roll. I should be able to, 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 to get that one in from there. Now, it'll take some practice because it is, you know, it is a hybrid and a lot of people aren't used to, you know, swinging it in this manner. But if you, you go out to your local practice facility, put a couple balls down about four or five yards off the green and try to get your pace right. And so we got both up and down for par there. So I, again, don't go for the highest lofted club in your bag, especially if you're playing early in the morning. Try to give yourself a keeping that ball on the green. For more golf tips and instruction, contact your local club professional. Ah, beautiful day in Baltimore, where most people will probably know that Geico could save their money on car insurance, right? But you see, the thing is, Geico, well, could help them save on boat insurance too. Hey. Okay, I'm ready to come in now. Hello? I'm trying my best. Seriously, I'm, I'm serious. Request to come ashore. Geico, saving people money on more than just car insurance. Introducing Toyota Reserve, the fast and easy way to secure your new Toyota, even if it's still in production. And with 10 manufacturing plants right here in the U.S., your new Toyota is closer than you think. And now's a great time to cash in on getting top dollar for your trade. So contact your dealer and reserve your new truck, car, or SUV today. Toyota, let's go places. Hi, my name is Stephen Fun, and this is my wife. Hi, Marjorie Fun. And these are the Fun Kids. We vacation in Ocean City, Maryland, because this town has our name written all over it. Fun, family of four, fun. We're the funs, not the boorings. If you're looking for family fun, do what the fun family does. Book a week in Ocean City, Maryland. Go to OCOcean.com and don't miss free events like movies on the beach. Nobody loves Ocean City golf more than Bobby V, except the girls at Pam's Golf. Check us out at tv.pamsocgolf.com, where you can request a free edition of our latest Play Golf magazine, the ultimate golf magazine resource for planning an awesome Ocean City golf vacation. Hey everyone, it's Mike Miller from Pittsburgh. I recently won the Pam's Golf Getaway Contest, where myself and six other friends were able to play four beautiful courses in Ocean City, Maryland. Uh, today we're sneaking out and uh, playing another 18. Pam's has been wonderful to work with. Uh, working with Sandra and Dana, they've given us just wonderful accommodations, wonderful uh, attention to everything that we've been looking for. We've gone to Star Restaurant twice, which is just phenomenal food. And for late October, early November, the golf couldn't be any better right here than in uh, Ocean City, Maryland. So make sure that you get Pam's a call for your next golf trip. I know that I will, and so will my friends. Cheers. We've booked over a million rounds of golf. Pam's is the biggest and the best. Nobody does Ocean City golf better. Call us at 888-222-GOLF. That's 888-222-4653. 
or visit us online at tv.pamsocgolf.com. We'll do all the work so you can have all the fun. Here are some great upcoming events in Ocean City, Maryland. To find out more information about these great events, call 1-800-OC-OCEAN or visit OCEOcean.com. I've travelled all over the country talking about saving with GEICO, but that's the important bit, isn't it? Showing up, saying, hello, fancy a nice chat. And then we talk like two old friends about sticky buns and all the savings you could get by bundling your home and car insurance. But here's the real secret. Eye contact. Do you feel that? We just had a moment. <laughs> Who'd have thought it? Geico. Save even more when you bundle home and car insurance. Introducing Toyota Reserve, the fast and easy way to secure your new Toyota, even if it's still in production. And with 10 manufacturing plants right here in the U.S., your new Toyota is closer than you think. And now's a great time to cash in on getting top dollar for your trade. So contact your dealer and reserve your new truck, car, or SUV today. Toyota, let's go places. Ocean City Golf Club, featuring 36 holes of championship golf. The beautiful Newport Bay Golf Course and the classic Seaside offer golfers two very distinct designs to choose from. Ocean City Golf Club blends spectacular views of the surrounding bays, woods, and wetlands with the enjoyment of quality golf. Come experience 36 of the most challenging and picturesque golf holes you'll find anywhere. Ocean City Golf Club in Ocean City, Maryland. Changing the course of golf in Ocean City. Well, that's all the time we have for this week's edition of Endless Golf. From the beautiful links at Lighthouse Sound right here in Ocean City, Maryland, a special thank you goes out to Diego Carrasco and the entire staff right here at Lighthouse Sound for their wonderful hospitality. If you'd like to book a tea time or a golf vacation here, make sure you use Ocean City's official golf package provider, Pam's Golf Getaways. Until next time, I'm your host, Bobby Vermillion. Hit them straight. So long, everybody. Thanks for watching Endless Golf with Bobby Vermillion. Endless Golf is brought to you by your local Toyota dealer. Toyota, let's go places. Discover Ocean City, Maryland. Book your Ocean City Golf Getaway now at ococean.com. Geico, 15 minutes could save you 15% or more on car insurance and by Pam's Ocean City Golf Getaways, the official golf package provider of Ocean City, Maryland.